now that you have the opportunity to try some awesome fun exercises and activities, um, we want to put it all together. If you're starting a new exercise program, check with your physician, physical therapist, or healthcare team before starting to ensure that it's safe. Try different activities that you like, most importantly, that you enjoy, because the consistency is more important than the quantity, okay? Incorporate different types of exercises in your regimen. It doesn't always need to be the same thing every day. You don't eat the same thing every day, so I'm sure you don't want to exercise and do the same exercise every day. So change it up. Start slow. Increase gradually. Any activity is good. Start with five minutes a day, 10 minutes a day. Give yourself a break. It's okay. Enjoy the process. Make exercise a habit. It's better to do it routinely in short bouts and consistent sessions than be the weekend warrior. Use strategies to increase your success. And most importantly, reward yourself, enjoy the process. Because if you enjoy it, it doesn't feel like work. Thank you so much for your participation in all the exercises through this conference. I hope this encourages you and inspires you to start different routines or start exercising. Contact us if you have any questions, and we look forward to seeing you next time. Thanks so much. Hello, everyone. My name is Nathan Perkins, and I'm here today to lead you in a 45-minute sit-and-fit exercise routine. Uh, we're going to be focusing on either improving or maintaining your endurance level, your strength levels or your range of motion through taking you through a variety of movements and exercises uh you don't have to do everything that i do in, in the video just do what you can uh and just try to have fun so we're going to go ahead and get get started here so i'm going to cue the music up and let's do it Okay, we're going to begin by bringing both hands together as best you can, and we're going to bring our arms all the way up, stretching out our shoulders. All right, and if you can, keep your both hands together, and we're going to lean to the left. And we're going to bring it back to the middle. Let's lean to the right. All right. And we'll bring it back to the middle, bring our arms down. And we're going to slowly now rotate our arms over to the left and look over our left shoulder as we go. All right, we'll bring our arms back to the middle, then we're going to slowly rotate our arms over to the right and look over our shoulder. All right, we'll slowly bring it back to the middle. Now sitting as tall as possible, we're going to slowly now tilt our heads over to the left, stretching out our neck. All right, and then slowly bring our heads back up and then slowly tilt our heads over to the right. All right, let's slowly bring our heads back up and now we're going to look up to the floors. And all the way up. Slowly bring our heads down to the center. Now we're going to slowly bring our heads back up. We're sitting nice and tall. We're going to start moving up our shoulders and our body as best we can. From both arms up to about shoulder height level. And we're just going to rotate side to side. And side to side. Right, right to left as best you can. Arms get a little heavy, you can bring your arms down to this level, just try to put the weight side to side. Side to side. And now moving on now, we're going to extend both arms out as best we can. And we're going to take up one arm over the other. Up to the right, right over left. Come up our shoulders. You can do this routine just about anywhere. You don't need to be lazy. 
studio, you can do this in, obviously in, in my bedroom. So go ahead and make the most of it. So we need to warm up here. So now we shake our arms out. All right, now we're gonna bring our arms up again and we're in small movements going. All movements backwards. All right, and then we're gonna shake our arms out. All right, standing as tall as we can, we're gonna go ahead and just work these bicep muscles here as best we can. And we're just gonna curl our arms up and down. I have to go slow, you can go at your own pace. Throw those arms up as best you can. And let's breathe. Excuse me. Inhale. Inhale. Up. Exhale as you breathe. Down. Good. Do three more. Here's three. And two. And one. All right. Before we go on, we're going to shake those arms out. I'm going to go ahead and do another set of these. So I'm going to just up and down. Pull those arms up. Just again. I'm going to do about 10 of these. So let's go ahead and do four more. There's four, three, two, and one. All right, let's shake our arms out again. Now we're going to work here. Uh, triceps here. We try to open up our hands as wide as possible. And we're just going to press down towards the floor. Now let's do five more. Five, and four, and three, and two, and one. All right, let's go ahead and shake those arms out again. We go forward. All right, spinning as tall as we can. We're gonna work these triceps by opening up, up, open up our hands nice and wide again. One, two, three, four. One more time, hold your breath as you can as we press downward. All right, let's do five more. There it is five, four, three, Two and one. All right, let's go ahead and shake those arms out again. All right, so now we're going to work our chest muscles here. In by extending both out, no, arms in and out. The chest muscles. In and out. Nice and slow. In and out. Going. All right, and three more. Three and two and one. And all right, bring your arms down if you need to. Shake those arms out. Pull your shoulders back. Try to keep your neck nice and loose. All right, we're going to do another set of these. We're going to start by arms all the way out and pull those arms in, in and out. In and out. In and out. Nice and controlled. In and out. In and out. Very good. Let's do five more. There's five. And four. And three. And two. And one. All right. Bring your arms down and shake those arms out again. Bring your arm across as best you can and take it across your body. Other arm. All right, very good. We're gonna move on. Work out these shoulders again by bringing your arms in by our side. We're gonna lift your arms up and down. Try to keep your neck nice and loose. Bring your arms up as best you can. Now, if this is too difficult for you, you can do one arm at a time. Alternating one arm at a time. But if you can, go ahead and do these together, up and down, nice and slow. 
Alright, let's do four more. There's four. And three. And two. And right, shake those arms out again. Alright, we're gonna do another set. We'll bring those arms in, elbows in. Those arms up and down as best you can. Okay. Up and down, working those shoulder muscles. Up and down, very nice. Up and down, best you can. Alright, very good. Let's do five more. Here's five. Four, three, and two, and one. All right. Now we're going to work these back muscles, posterior muscles. You can imagine as if we're going to pick up something off the floor. We're going to slightly lean forward as best you can, arms out in front. We're going to go ahead and grab it up. And as we grab it up, we're going to bring it as high as we can and bring those shoulder blades together. We're going to go up and down, nice and smooth. Bringing our shoulder blades together, opening up our chest nice and wide. Way up, as best you can. Way up. Way up, good. Okay, three more. There's three. And two. And one. All right. Turn back up and if you need to again, shake those arms out. Imagine again, we're picking something up, something up before, and bring your arms up and down, good. Down, nice and smooth. As you bring your arms up, try to squeeze your shoulder blades together, opening up that chest nice and wide. All right, very good. Let's keep it going. All right, we have three more. Three, and two, and one, all right, we turn back up. Go ahead now, let's roll our shoulders back. Now we're gonna lift our shoulders up and down. All right, so now we're gonna work our abdominal muscles as best we can. We're gonna begin by imagining as if we've got a baby in front of us. Imagine that, hold our arms here, like so. We're going to just walk side to side. It's a little bit too heavy for this. You can bring your arms down to down towards your waist into the side to side and feel the movement. But if you can, you can bring your arms up to about shoulder height level. Just walk side to side. Side to side. Feel the movement in your trunk to take it from left to right, right to left. Side to side. Couple more side to sides here. All right, very good. Just bring it back in the middle. If you need to shake those arms out, as two cells if you need to. And let's do one more set. Hold our arms again. One side to the other. As high as you can to the left, as high as you can to the right. Side to side. Side to side. Side to side. All right, very good. Now let's bring it back to the middle. Shake your arms out. All right, so now we're going to do another abdominal. All right, that's good for you. We're going to fold our arms here, cross our shoulders. There you go. Now, Try to keep your abdominal muscles as tight as you can. Slowly come forward, back up. Good. Up and down. All right, we're gonna do five more. Here's five, and four, and And one, and back up, and let's go ahead and shake those arms out. All right, before we move on, we're just gonna bring both hands together, and we're gonna big stretch up, all the way up to the side, cover the body all the way up. 
keeping the arm down. Very nice. I will fold our arms again, working those abdominals. Up and down. Height. Normally, as we go up and down. All right, let's keep it going. Good job. Keep it going. All right, we're going to do four more. Four and three and two and one. And back up and again, let's shake those arms out. All right, if those arms are feeling a little bit heavy, let's go ahead and extend the right arm all the way up and let the other arm hang down. And now we're going to try to lean as far as we can over to the left. Feel that stretch through your shoulders. It's very long side here. You take it all the way as you can to the left. All right, very good. Let's return back up and lower that arm down by your side. Let's go ahead and extend the Opposite arm all the way up, so as tall as you can, and go ahead and just lean to the other side. All right, very good. Return back up and just pull that arm down by your side and just shake both arms out. All right, so we're going to move on here. We're going to imagine if we're washing the table. We're going to begin with our right hand. Just up your lap, we're just going to take it. All rotations, watch the table, the out in front, and around and around, around and around. All right now, we're going to go in the opposite direction, around and around, around and around. All right, very good. Now let's go ahead and let's try to use the other arm. I'll come and now we'll go around and around again. Let's go in the opposite way. Around and around. All right, very good. Now let's go ahead and shake those arms out again. Now we're going to imagine as if we're washing the table, starting with our right hand, rotations, excuse me, washing the window, I said window, uh, I mean window, but washing the note, round and around. All right, let's go opposite direction. Round and around. All right, very good. Now let's go ahead now and switch hands. Let's continue to wash that window with the opposite hand. Round and around. All right, very good. Now let's go in the opposite. Round and around. All right, very good. Now let's go ahead and shake those arms out. On. All right, so now we're going to imagine it as if we're in a swimming pool. We begin with our backstroke. Bring that arm up and back as best you can and feel that movement to your shoulders. Open up right to left, left to right. Feel that in your shoulders. Um, up and back as best you can. Imagine yourselves a nice warm day. Cool. Come on back, all about the other. On each arm. Right there. Good. That was into Arm or freestyle for you swimmers. Let's go ahead and bring that arm up and reach out as best you can. And, uh, up as well, reach out as best you can. And 
arms out as best you can or reach. Feel those movements in your shoulders. Nice and smooth. One more time, each arm. All right, very good. And let's go ahead and shake those arms out one more time. And one more stroke, and that stroke is the breaststroke. Together, let's just spread them apart. Spread them apart. All right, let's do three and two and one, and bring your arms in. You two, stick those arms out. Go ahead and sit as tall as we can. Pull our shoulders back. And neck and shoulders nice and loose. All right, then we're gonna lift our shoulders up and down. All right, very good. Now we're just gonna imagine it as if we have Wings, and we're going to extend both arms out, back of our arms, and wings, up our arms as best we can, wings, into a nice light, back up, up and down, good, up and down, up and down. All right, very good. Shake those arms out. Okay, so now we're going to bring our arms in by our side and we're turn our palms up. Right, slowly bring our arms back. Bring our shoulder blades together. Hold it there. Just nice and wide. Slowly then release. Bring your arms forward. Again, slowly bring your arms back. You just nice and wide, bring your shoulder blades together, hold it there. Alright, very good. And then you just back, forward, back in, and your arms back. Put your shoulder blades together, just nice and wide. Alright, very good. And your arms forward again, this is the size. Back in your chest and your shoulders. Bring those arms back again, squeeze your shoulder blades together, hold it there. Forward and relax, let's do that one more time. Only bring your arms back, squeeze your shoulder blades together. All right, very good, and slowly bring your arms forward and relax. Let's bring all those shoulders back again. All right, very good. So for our next exercise, we're going to our chest muscles and our back muscles almost at the same time. We're going to begin by opening our hands nice and wide, our arms back to the back. And so we're going to push forward, work on our chest muscles, and we're going to pull back. Use those posterior muscles, our back muscles. Go ahead now, push forward, big push forward. Look at this. Bring it back. Forward. Push forward again. Take that fist and pull it back. Again. Push forward all the way out. Push it out. Take that fish. Excuse me. Lift that fist and bring it all the way back. One more. And push forward. Big push. Lift that fist all the way back. All right. Bring your arms down. You can shake those arms out. All right, let's do that again. Hands nice and wide, best you can, and push forward. Take that fist, and pull back. Push forward. Good. Take that fist, pull back. Good. Again, push forward. Pull back. Let's do two more. Push. Hold and pull back. All right, one more time. Put up that hand nice and wide. 
big push all the way out. Take that fist all the way back. All right, and bring your arms down. All right, roll those shoulders back. All right, now let's just for a moment rotate again over to the right and look over our right shoulder as the best. All right, let's turn to the middle. Slowly rotate our arms over to the left. Let's try and look over again for our left shoulder. All right, bring it back to the middle. All right, and sitting nice and tall. Work our biceps again, but this time we're going to begin by placing both hands on our shoulders with our elbows pulling out. Extend our arms out like so. Move your hands back to your shoulders, just up and down. Feel smooth, good. Nice and controlled. As best you can. Good. All right, let's keep it going. Nice and smooth. Okay, we're going to do three more here. Three. And two. And one. All right, bring your arms down. Shake them out again. Those same biceps here. Just go ahead and place our hands on our shoulders. Right, as best you can. Point those elbows out like so. Just bring your arms out and back. Out and back. Out and back. And back. Out and back. Four more. Out and back. Out and back. Two more. Out and back. One more. Out and back. All right. Bring your arms down. Shake them out again. All right. So now we're going to imagine if this were on slopes okay. each hand so <clears throat> excuse me and then we're just going to go forward big strokes going forward big strokes going forward big strokes going forward big strokes big strokes Big strokes. All right, very good. Now let's go ahead and let's go in the opposite direction. Big strokes in the opposite direction. Very nice. Big strokes all the way back. All right, very good. Let's do three more. Three and two. And one, all right, bring your arms down. Before we go on, let's just sit as tall as we can. Again, let's slowly tilt our heads over to the left, the left shoulder. Slowly bring our heads back up. Now slowly tilt our heads over to the right. Slowly bring our heads back up. Now slowly tilt our heads up towards the ceiling, look up. Slowly bring your head down to the middle. Now let's slowly look down towards the floor. All right, and slowly back up. All right, so these next few exercises, we're just going to focus on our hands here. Again, by just opening and closing our hands. Nice and wide. Opening and closing our hands. Let those fingers. All right, very good. Let's do three more. All right, so now the next one, we're just gonna simply turn our hands over and under. And under. Over. All right, now we're gonna move on here. Now we're gonna turn our palms up, so up and down. Yeah. 
Up and down. Very good. Up and down. Couple more. All right, so now we're going to turn our palms. Down and go up and down. Keep going in. up and down as best, best as you can. Up and down. All right, three more. Three, two, and one. And then shake both hands out. All right, again, rotate again as best you can over to the left. Left shoulder. Okay, we're going to go back to the middle. We'll slowly rotate our arms over to the right. Just pull our shoulder. All right, we'll bring it back to the middle. Gather ourselves. Now we're going to bring both arms down by our side. We're going to just stretch out our shoulders as we finish up here. Slowly extend our arms up, and we're going to form the letter I. Bring your arms up as high as you can. Hold it there and try to feel that stretch in your shoulders. All right, very good. And slowly bring your arms down. All right, the next letter we're going to form is the letter Y. Take your arms up. Back, a little bit chest nice and wide. Very good. Wide. All right. Forward and down by the side. Next letter we're going to form is the letter W. So you bring your arms up and imagine if we're going to letter W by bringing our shoulders in, keeping the shoulder blades together, and holding it there as if you're forming the letter W. All right, very good. Then bring your arms again down by your side. All right, next letter we're going to form is the letter T. Arms to our shoulder height level. Take your arms back. Squeeze your shoulder blades together. Hold it there just for a moment as best as you can. All right, very good. Bring your arms down by your side. All right, next letter we're going to form the letter L. Bring your arms and elbows in to our your side, bring your shoulder blades together, imagine you forming a letter L with your arms. So, all right, very good, bring your arms forward down on your side, and now we're going to form a half X. We're going to turn our palms towards the camera monitor just in front of you, put your arms straight back and put your shoulder blades together, as you can to hold it there. As nice and wide as best you can. All right, very good. Bring your arms forward, down by side and forward. Now we're going to stretch out our hands. We're going to start with our right hand, extend our right arm out. Grab our fingers and pull our hand downward. Very good. Now we're going to open up the hand nice and wide. Okay. So, and if you need to, you can shake that hand out. All right, now we're going to touch up the left hand or the right. Grab our fingers, move your hand downward. All right, very good. Now let's open up that hand nice and wide. That hand back. All right, very good. If you need to, you can shake out both hands. All right, now we're finishing up here by bringing both arms down by your side, sitting as tall as possible. Slowly extend our arms up. As we slowly extend our arms up, we're going to take a big inhale through our nose as we lift our arms all the way up. Inhaling through our nose. Slowly bring your arms down. Exhaling through your mouth. Good. Again, slowly extend your arms up all the way up. Inhaling through your nose. 
gently bring your arms down, exhaling through your mouth. And slowly extend your arms up all the way up, inhaling through your nose. Slowly bring your arms down, exhaling through your mouth. One more time. Slowly extend your arms up all the way up as best as you can, inhaling through your nose. Now slowly bring your arms down, exhaling through your mouth. All right, and then to end, we're gonna bring your arms up to about shoulder height level, your arms back. Now bring your arms in and give yourself a hug. And bring your right arm over your left and pat yourself up over yourself. Good job today. All right, those arms out one more time, nice and wide. This time, bring those arms in again. Take the left arm over the right. Give yourself a little at shoulders. All right, next. Then both arms out, pulling them down by your side, shaking them out. We are all done. I hope these exercises were, are beneficial to you. Remember, you can do them at any time, any place, in your bedroom. I Doing these here today. So, just want to encourage you to do the best you can and to remember always have fun. Have a great day. See you later.